What's up, y'all? It's me, Nate Almighty. And I'm back with another Raisin Canaan. Season 3 Theory, man. Matter of fact, because we know Bettina Miller is going to be, I mean, well, no. Season 3 Theory still, because even if she's in Season 4, this theory still, apl- this theory still applies to Season 3, right? And this theory is, Canaan forces Raquel to retire from the game and finally get out his face in business by threatening to expose her being a rat. Snitching. Right? Right? And I think that this could be an angle Kanan really decides to take after he finds out for sure that Raquel was Howard's informant. Now, Kanan said, if he was telling the truth, he said to Tariq and OG Power, he said, hey, um, we was hustling for my uncles at a certain point in the past and had something to do with most of the time and all that, right? So, that means that Raquel was not around. Or she was alive but she wasn't in the game because Raquel would have wanted to be the boss of the situation. He spoke on it like Lulu and Marvin were bosses, right? So, Kanan is someone who, because we have the trope and power of parents killing, I mean, parents either killing their kid, only one example of that. For real. That's when Kanan killed Sean. But mostly fathers being killed by their sons. Because we have that trope. A lot of people think that Kanan may end up killing his mom. Right? Because she's getting in his way. Right? Which is why Tariq killed Ghost. Which is why Ghost killed Breeze. Right? But I think Kanan is not that gangster. Not even gangster, right? We're talking about taking out your mom, right? The person who, even though over the last, what is it, year? (laughs) The last, like, Raising Canaan has only been like a year, two max. Before that, she's your mom. She took care of you when you were sick. She rubbed um, uh, Vicks on your chest and all that when you were sick and and you know (laughs) took the boogers out your nose when you was a baby and all that Kanan's not gonna kill Raquel and Raquel's obviously not gonna kill Kanan so how would he get his mother out of his business and out of his life he would say I'm gonna tell everybody you're a rat and I'm gonna tell everybody Howard is my father I don't care. At the end of the day, I'm going to be in the streets. And anybody who got a problem with it, I'm going to kill them. But nobody is going to rock with you. Nobody going to rock with him. I mean, if it goes that way and he mad at Howard, and he can use that as leverage. Or, or he don't got to be mad at Howard. Or Howard will just be a, a casualty in that situation. He could be like, and I know for a fact, you ain't going to do nothing. What are you going to do? Kill me? Do it. Do it. Do it. They can even, like, hype it up and have a, like, point a gun at him and said, I'll kill you. And he could put his head to the gun <laughs> and say, so do it then, mom. Kill your son. Right? And then she could say, all right, I'm out then. Like, they could, it could be a big thing. She could leave the house and... Nobody know where she at for a couple of days. And then she could be like, all right, I'm out. You want to be a man, be a man. I'm out. I'm out. Because you destroying my legacy is like, I have a whole bunch of people trying to kill me. Also, it'll still make your life more dangerous too. So I'd rather kill two birds with one stone, protect us both. I just leave the game, right? And it's like, I feel like there's no other way. Unless somebody 
unless somebody kills Raquel, right? Which is not going to be easy to do. Especially after she already almost died. Unless somebody kills Raquel or Raquel just decides to really leave on her own. That's the best option Kanan has for real. What other option does he have? Because I don't believe he's going to kill his mother. It's not going to happen. I don't think it's going to happen. Especially in these days and times with, with the girl bosses and everything. They're not going to have. They're not brave enough. They're not brave enough to have a uh, a character like Kanan take out his mom. They, that's just something that they're not going to do. They're not going to do, right? Because it puts her in a weaker position. I think when it's all said and done, Rock is either going to have an, a Scarface-esque kind of death where she going to go out like a, like, a, like a big gangster, right? Like a big gangster. Or she's going to be able to get away with it and run away. Fake her death or something like that. I believe that those are the only two ways they're going to have her go out. Anything else, anything else would be pitiful at this point. Plus, I don't want to see her go out any other way either at this point. She's my favorite character on the show. But, um, y'all let me know what y'all think. What other ways would Kanan be able to get away from Raquel? Get away from her grip, right? Like, share, comment, subscribe. Peace.